Mm. <laughs> so today we're going to go morel hunting. My kids are all covered up with their buffs. They got their hair covered, wearing their light colored shirts. We got our clothes uh, sprayed down. They got sprayed down with um, permethrin last night. And then we're all sprayed with DEET. And then we have our long socks on, covering our pants. And we got our shoes and skin sprayed also with DEET. So let's go ahead and get some morels. So here's the first one we found, but it looks like it was either stepped on or it's kind of dried up. The nettles. <laughs> so here's what it looks like up close. And we're just going to go ahead and crush it up and let some of the spores out so that it can make more morels for next year. So Jaya just found a bunch. Do you guys see them? And they're under, they're hiding under all this bark. And, oh, look at that. Stay still, honey. Look. Stay still because there's more right here. Look. Come on, get up. Move. There's a little one. And there's some more. I bet if we move this, we might find some too. Look at those ones. Aww. That's a real gray one right there. Isn't it? This might be a good place to look too. Let's keep looking. Let's see that. Oh, yeah. Look at those. Healthy. Nice, nice. Golden morels. Can't wait till we get out of this den, bruh. Yep. We need to go. Shamar. Huh? Here. You found one? Get this one. Look at that one. You pick it from the bottom, okay? Your mama stuck. Oh, I see it. <laughs> you see it, Jamar? Okay. Okay. So keep looking because that means there might still be some where you were too, Zay, because you found them over there. This is going to be an area we got to come back. Just gotta watch out for nettles though too. Okay, Shamar. Kick from the bottom. Let me see, Shamar. I smell dog foot. Let me see. It smells like what? Dog foot. Dog foot? Yeah, a dog foot. You like it? <laughs> it's got an earthy smell, uh, doesn't it? It smells uh, like the woods. And the... I would like to take a bite of it right now. Nope, nope. Never eat a mushroom raw. Oh, Never. Dad. Oh, that's good. <laughs> Just so kidding. Funny. You found another one? Okay. Ooh, let me see, Jamar. Keep looking, you guys. Uh, let me see, Jamar. Like oh, boy! Oh, right there, Jai. Ooh, let's see him. Right there. We're with the master. Huh? We're with you. We're with uh oh, with the morel master. <laughs> I couldn't find one to save my life yesterday. You found one, Zay? 
Did you find one over there, buddy? Yeah. Where was it at? Point to where it was at, because that was right there. Right here. Right where? Right there. See the oh, you picked it? I have your water. Oh, good. Okay, keep looking and, and just kind of stop. Oh, before you walk, stop and look. A lot Tread of they're, lightly. <laughs> they're, they're hidden underneath. Sometimes the roots go out as far as the crown goes, you know? So you have to think way far out. Get your water. Okay. Mm. You found one over there, Jai? Yep. I didn't even find even one yet. I didn't even find one from even me find the by itself. There's a look like up there you can see that I know if you're looking at it, it's really hard to find. Uh -huh. Oh, I see one. I see one. Right there. Who sees nice it? Nice find. Who sees it? Yeah. There yep. it is. My first one. Woohoo! <laughs> my first one. <laughs> All right. We're getting our morale. On. Let me see it, Jamar. Put it in your bag. Don't you guys remember the uh, Oh, the good doggy smell. Yep. Remember that? Let me see, Jamar. I sit there and say, I see five morels. Mm. The doggy smell. Oh, oh yeah. Look at those beautiful morels. So this is our next location. This little dead elm right Whoa, here. And we're going to look all around the vicinity of it. We have to find at least one here. You think? That would be like portend good luck, wouldn't it? Right? I, so. I found some in the past yesterday. In, down, or not yesterday, the other day. That's where I would hide if I was a mushroom. That's where I would grow. <laughs> I love the moss this time of year. It's just so lush and clean and beautiful. Look at that, you guys. So pretty. So, so pretty. Red straw. <laughs> Pine cones. It's just beautiful. Here's a jack in the pulpit. I was just told that this, seeing one of these is also a good signal of morel season as well as the lilac bushes blooming. Up here we have some fiddlehead ferns. And some people like to eat these. Cook them up and eat them. See them you guys? More beautiful moss. Look at that, you guys. That's so pretty. Look at this rock, you guys. This is covered with moss and ferns. And we're in southeastern Minnesota. If anyone was wondering where we're at. Going under some branches. Hi, 
That was a mushroom. Oh, really hot. Right in here, I think. You did? Oh, this looks so cool. Fuck you guys. Okay, but it ran stop. Follow this deer path here. Please hear the birds. So pretty. Is that a cardinal? I think so. I like that. All right, I see some. We had a lot of luck here last year, but they were like spread out. So we can see and find a few here and find a few there. So Bob is always the one who's looking up in the air. <laughs> looking as we come towards it. These aren't bugs. Mm, mm. Dead. Mm, yeah, mm. but look at the bark. That's not a. So an elm tree has got a smoother bark. So if you see an elm and the bark's falling off like this one and it's smooth, this is potentially a good place to look also underneath. Okay, see how the bark's coming off of this? You could tell by looking at the top that it's a dead tree. And you guys see this jumbo mushroom down here? That's a pheasant back and it is really big. It's bigger than than probably one and a half or two of my hands put together. It's really huge. And those can be eaten too, but I think it's... I was told it's too big to eat. Look at this beauty. Peeling bark galore. Oh, and look, you guys, I found okay, a tiny one. Watching. You see it? Okay, wait a minute, wait a minute. Stop. Look at his little baby. Yeah. Aww. And Jaya just found more. But she just picked them. Maybe we'll find more hiding. I found another one, you guys. Look. Look, you guys, there's huh? more. I don't see one, no, but I'm telling you, it's easier if you're looking up the hill than down twins. the hill. Yeah. Oh, it's a twin. Aww. Oh, I see one right there. Look. Ah. Look at that look, one. Jamar, pick that one. one for me. Pick that one for me. For you? Oh, yeah. yeah. For you? Okay, here. Yeah. But they're the line. Like well, we're going to put them in your bag. Okay. Did you pick them on this up by the tree yet? Okay, there's a lot over here, you guys. Look, there's these. Okay, wait a minute. Let everybody look. Come on, look. Safe. Okay, there. There. Look at that. Look. How many can you count? Everybody stop and count how many you can count. I see three. And here is a pheasant back. And these are edible. Aren't they pretty, you guys? Oh, wow. Look, can you touch my fingers? Yeah, we can touch it. So here's the underside of the pheasant back. What would my wood call? A pheasant back. A pheasant. Here's the top. It. 
You want to hold it? It's nice, isn't it? Be mine. It's gonna be yours. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna put it in the bag with the others. Yeah. And here's some wild now, ginger. Here's the flower. Oh, yeah. yeah, pretty soon, honey. After about two and a half hours of morel hunting, this is what we found. couple pheasant backs. Here is our stash. I was just told that this is not the sort of morels you want to get right here with the dirt. You want to pull them off right before the dirt. You want to leave that little chunk down in the ground still. But, you know, a few of us were picking together and to be honest, I didn't know my stepmom is the expert. My dad's the expert. So yeah, you guys, thank you so much for coming along. If you like this sort of video, if you want to see more nature style videos in the future, please show me some love by hitting the thumbs up button. Share with me down in the comments. And if you haven't yet, hit that little button subscribe. Well, all right, you guys, thank you so, so much for watching. Bye.